Um, so you're probably wondering, whoa, what's up with your hair? Um, so, where do I start? Last video, you guys see I didn't have dreads anymore, obviously. It was my curly hair, my normal hair. Now, after that video, I went to the hair salon, and then I told the lady what I kind of wanted, like, I just need to get up and go, put my hair up, blah, super easy, like... And I just explain to her what I want, and I don't have to, like, worry about anything, basically. Like, with curly hair, I had to straighten the top and then put products in the bottom of my hair so it doesn't frizz up. And then when I put it up in a ponytail, it gets all poofy. Um, but, yeah, so she suggested permanently straightening it. And she gave it to me for a really good price, so, so far I like it. Um, and I'm surprised because... Usually, like, when I think of permanently straightening people's hair, it's like, they, their hair looks super damaged. And mine actually is really healthy-ish looking. Um, although it is thin, I guess. But who cares? And then, after this goes out, I'm not going to do the touch-ups, I don't think. I'm going to dread my hair again, hopefully. Um, but yeah, I did a little cool design in there. And you know what I always wanted to do? Well, maybe a okay, maybe after this goes out or something like that, um, I'm gonna like shave these two parts, like the side parts, like this part. Then I'm gonna like do a mohawk type thing, but it's gonna be short hair, you know. It's gonna be like Like, kind of like Megan Rafano from, um, Rafino from the U.S. soccer team. Kind of like that. Or like Romy from The Real L Word, if you watch that. But I always loved that hairstyle. So, now with straight hair, I can totally do it. Like, I can totally see myself doing it. But yeah, it's people that are thinking of permanently straightening their hair, I say go for it. Because, I mean, I don't know. It's cool, and it feels so weird to just... Yeah, like run my fingers through my hair all that fun stuff and then I can look like the girl from the grudge but yeah um yes anyways um people that read books I suggest first of all Hunger Games that's an amazing book and the movie's coming out so you might as well read it now um because if you kind of like New Moon and Twilight, once you see the characters, you're going to have them in your brain. But anyways, read Hunger Games. Then I just read um, Divergent, another amazing book. It's based, I like books about survival, like you have to survive somewhere. Um, but yes, um, and then read Unwind too. My friend told me about that, and that's an amazing book. Um, so yeah, I will talk to you guys later. Um, I'll do more updates later on, like, I think I'm going to do book reviews now. I don't know why, but I've been reading a lot. Um, and I'm going to be doing more random videos. So, and if you guys read The Hunger Games, tell me, what team are you? Team PETA or Gale? Alrighty. Talk to you guys later. Peace out, Girl Scout.